Bear needs to get some more SCVs on minerals. Still continuing to produce stores and tanks, so he's going a factory heavy build. Be interesting, interesting to see how a marine medevac marauder build would go. But I send in about 10 lings or so to try to mop up those spine crawlers. I kill two of them, I believe, and I'm gonna start killing all these drones. So you cannot run from me. I am way too fast for you. And <laughs> I go in his mineral line and burrow for another day. If only these zerglings regenerated like the roaches do, but unfortunately they do not. I'm just continuing to pump zerglings and infestors. A nice combination. Infestors very gas heavy. Zerglings obviously not. And my life pushing in once again with lots of hydras and roaches. Still continuing with the upgrade. So two armor <clears throat> on these roaches with one armor upgrade now. And they are now playing defensively. They're not even going to try to come down here and defend this. My life is carrying us at this point. I'm just trying to support him all I can with, with my investors. Six mutas coming up. He must have spotted my expansion somehow. Let's see. Yeah, maybe it got scanned or something, but he's just going to focus that down. I have nothing to save it. My life would just be wasting his time if he were to run all the way up there and try to stop that. So I'm not going to worry about it. Or am I? Look at this. I've got five investors. Fungal growth, of course, does 34 damage over 8 seconds, so 4 fungal growths would do uh, 136 damage. Yeah, that's right. So I should just need 4 fungal growths, and look at this, I hit all 6 of the mutalists. I'm not going to be able to stop them from taking out my hatchery. 1 fungal growth, 2 fungal growths. Now, I could spawn infested Terrans right now, but I'm not sure if they would even get the job done. Their damage is just so low, so 3, 4th fungal growth here. And I'm, I'm looking at the life and I'm not quite sure if I timed it well enough to actually kill them. So I just go ahead and sludge another one on them. And boom, all six mutalists are dead. So six infestors just destroyed six mutalists with just one spell. So that was pretty cool. I was pretty happy about that. Uh, I was probably giggling. Going to expand to my main base, if that makes sense, with another hatchery. Looking decent at this moment. He has three bases over here. My life does. Taking a fourth base. We have scouts on the map, I believe. Do we have an overlord around here? No. Oh, wait. Yep. Nope. That's his tumor. Never mind. So we don't have as many scouts as we should, considering we ha we both have overlord speed, and the overlords are just kind of sitting around. We have the tower, so we can see this expansion. No, he has the towers. Again, don't listen to anything I say. I obviously have no idea what I'm talking about. My life does have the burrow movement research. They're pretty fast on the creep, but then they get slow on the non-creep. But, how fortunate, nup, wow, that's a very good scan, that came out of nowhere, so, uh, that's, that's pretty strange, I, <laughs> I'm not sure how he knew to scan there, but, they know our roaches are approaching, a overseer has been morphed, and look at all these tanks, and this Thor, mutas, and lings to support that, I don't know if we'll be able to, uh, move up on this position or not. I've got my six infestors down here to support, and at this point, I'm like, okay, my life, this is it. I'm going to send in my links first to eat up some of the cannon blasts, and then we will move in and try to win this game. He is telling me, wait, I have a lot of reinforcements, and he is certainly right. He has quite a few men coming down to reinforce that. Meanwhile, I'm putting down my spire, and I'm going to start training lots of lings because, or uh, mutalists, because mutas do very good against Thors, as everyone knows, so that is a very smart decision not. And here is the army from my life. It is finally there to support. Infestors hopefully going to do some fungal growthing and neuroparasiting. So here we go. Ling going first. Eat up a couple blasts. Infestors are following. Thor quickly goes down. Tanks blasting away, doing a lot of damage. But I do suck up two of the tanks. I need to get my other four infestors in there to fungal growth. But look at this. There's nothing to fungal growth. It's all dead. So these two tanks are mine. <laughs> I actually fungal growth the drones. Four mutas coming in. Probably going to try to kill these two infestors, but they can't even get to them. Only one of them can, but you can tell that my life's army is just too huge, so nice macro play on his part. And, uh, you know, maybe without the Infestors we would have lost, but it's hard to say, so good game on both sides, guys. Thanks for watching.